This video tutorial will show you how to update and complete your profile in a few simple steps. After you've logged into the site, you'll want to select your name in the upper left-hand corner. A drop-down will appear. Select Profile. To edit your profile, click on the Edit Profile link to the right. From here, you'll want to complete your personal profile information with your first name, last name, a short biography, websites you may have, and your social media accounts. Save your profile by selecting the green Save button at the bottom of the page. Next, you'll want to update your work information so your peers can learn more about your job and your responsibilities. To do so, click on the work link at the top of the page. Please enter your employer name, company website, company revenue, number of salespeople, and current occupation. Providing this information will facilitate collaboration with your peers at similar sized companies. Additionally, please enter your company's address and contact information. Sharing the applications that you use will also facilitate collaboration with your peers. In order to select apps, click the plus sign next to the category and click the checkbox next to the apps that you use. In future application plans, please enter whatever applications you're planning to install in future or to explore the use of within your company. You should also, for a more complete profile, enter your areas of expertise and areas of interest. The more complete your profile, the easier it will be for other users of the sales op shop who share your interests or who use similar applications to find you. Once you have completed filling out this section of the profile, click Save. To add a profile photo, click the photo link at the top of the Profile Edit screen. On this screen, you may click the blue Browse button to navigate your hard drive and select the photo that you wish to use. Please keep in mind that this photo will be used in various sizes so we recommend using a headshot, which will be visible regardless of the presentation size. Once you have selected a photo, click the Upload File button. The page will notify you when the upload of your photo is complete. If you'd like to adjust your privacy settings and decide who can and cannot view parts of your profile information, you'll want to select the Privacy link at the top. Once you've updated your privacy settings, please remember to save so that they take effect. Select the Back to Profile text link and your profile is complete. This concludes our profile editing video tutorial.